Yes, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for the first to the channel. First of all, a massive sorry for the lack of update recently. I haven't been able to do any proper videoing, any proper montage of stuff, any proper recording, um, due to the fact that we are having the kitchen redecorated. And I have uh, captured some footage of that as well, posted some uh, photos on the community page. And things are starting to look good. But yeah, the house was a mess and it was a bit tiring to have it all torn up and having uh, to cook on just one little induction plate and not having a proper stove or even coffee etc. So yeah, it, it was a bit off-putting. I have recorded some little bits. The Discord server has been uh, rearranged by Fizzy and I did spend a weekend in Overload at Midi Tracks and Midi Tracks is a great event, the biggest event worldwide when it comes to German vehicles on World War II. Last year, as in last weekend, they had 110 vehicles, 58 teams, 12 countries. This is the biggest event for everybody who has been interested in German car technology on World War II. And of course, they also had a few tanks. And first and foremost was this machine, not the Hatzer in front, but this bugger. Richard Cutland, the challenger for Wargaming, sitting in uh, the back hatch of the Panther, which was brought all the way over from Samur. Musée, Musée de Blinde, the French tank museum, they had a running King Tiger last year and they had a running Panther this year. And you can see also at the back, there are soft skins driving around, there are tanks driving around, there are half tracks sitting at the back. Uh, you might even be able to catch a glimpse of the sh which is there as well. Yeah, there it is. You see it behind the barrel? There was a stoop, there was a hatzer, but they after 17 from the Wheeled Foundation as well. There's Harkonnen with the checkered blouse now behind the tree and now in front of a tree and still filming on the left hand side of the Panther. PC contributor as well. Sophie was there, PC contributor and Rita Gamer. And it was just, it was a magnificent event. I was allowed and able to climb inside of the panther oh lucky me oh i was fanboying all over the place and this is the driver's seat as you can see not a lot to see through that uh, vision slit this is the assistance driver's seat with a well a machine gun ball in front this is a radio rack um, and it's not it's not massive really actually in in terms of restoration there is still work that needs to be done but it is a running tank and they do miss the gunner's seat actually so uh, they, they are missing that this is uh, the gun not really complete but you can see all the major bits are here and this is some from something from the crew smoke mortar over there but just seeing that panther drive around it was really really great to see so we are going to start up the next little bit of video in uh, well just a few seconds and I'll then just shut up because it is far too good to talk over this. This is Rita over here. She was lucky enough to be able to crank up the Panther, the engine to whirl that one around. And I'll just shut up now, let you enjoy the footage. If you can come to Militrex next year, which will be the third weekend of May 2020, do come over. It's a splendid event which you will not want to miss. As for now, ladies and gentlemen, tankers of British Universe, thank you for your patience. I'll catch you all on the next video. Cheers, happy tanking, and enjoy the Panther at Militrex 2019. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>